We've been talking about this guest all morning, multi-talented recording artist. John Batiste took home an impressive five, five awards at the 2022 Grammys, including Album of the Year for his EP, We Are. And We Are is currently number one, of course, on the R&B and Soul Charts on iTunes. And this morning, here to talk about those exciting Grammy wins, his number one album, and oh, so much more, is the man himself, John Batiste. Do you? Oh, oh my yes. God. It is so nice to have you. It's so good to see you. Oh, good to have you. And you're the real deal, because you were dancing even there behind the wings oh. there. Uh, oh, congratulations. Really? Yes. Congratulations. Congrats. Yes, indeed. We having a good time. Life is beautiful. Amen. Yes, it yeah. is. I, I mean, what? I mean, five wins at the Grammys, <laughs> album of the wow. year. What is it like to be you right now? <laughs> it's, it's, um, it's amazing to see not only the wins, but to have my family there with me. Yeah. yeah. My grandfather is almost 90 years old. Wow. Oh, wow. He was sitting right there in the center in the king's chair. <laughs> and he saw his grandson walk on the stage and win album of the year. Oh, my goodness. Okay, and my just... nephew was seven. Seven. We recorded this. He was five when we recorded this. He's the youngest Grammy winner ever. Oh, that's that's right. Because they, they also part of this. They were the part of it, right? He was featured on the track We Are. Mm -hmm. And... It's the first track of the album. It features my high school marching band, the St. Aug Marching 100, legendary high school alumni marching band I was part of. And it was basically the whole city that I, I, I grew up with, everybody that I could think of that was important to me growing up in New Orleans, I put on this album and featured. And all of them have Grammys now. Yeah. That's the beauty. It's not just me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The whole community. We are. Everybody. Yeah. We are. So, you know, when I listen to this album and I see it's number one and I see everybody's, you know, renewed excitement for this, this, this record, I, I'm, I'm so moved because it was not just me. Mm -hmm. yeah. It was so many of us. And, you're, you're saying, and you say busy, you know, I was just thinking about this because those Grammys won't be lonely because they join your Oscar oh. for the 2020 animated film Soul. Oh, yes, yes. Where do you keep all of these? Where are you keeping them all now? I, I, have, uh, I have a plan. Okay. Oh. See, I want to take everything that I, I win, um, everything that I'm acknowledged for, and, and use it to inspire people. Okay. I want to figure out something, whether it's an archive, whether it's some sort of museum placement, even just somewhere back home or somewhere That's that great. young people can see it. Because I don't want to just have awards that collect dust in, mm -hmm. in my house and remind me of what I did in the past. Amen. Mm. I want to keep moving. Yes. I'm creating. I'm, I'm ready to make the next thing. I have a symphony that's premiering in May in Carnegie Hall. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Come, come tell us, come uh, out. Come. yes. Where's this? Yes. May Done. 7th. It's, Done. It's, it's May 7th in, in Carnegie Hall. It's um, incredible for me because it's the first time I'm premiering something this large. Mm. It's a, it's a four-movement over 200 musicians, the modern definition for me of what a symphony orchestra would be. If it was made in the 21st century yeah. mm -hmm. in America, it would have, you know, marching band musicians next to classical musicians, next to indigenous folk musicians and Native American musicians, mm -hmm. next to jazz musicians, yeah. next to electronic musicians. That's going to be a wow, massive piece. Wait, I know. And, wow. and, 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 you know, you, we've been marking your professional milestones, but you recently created a new personal mi milestone, marrying Suleika. <laughs> Your longtime partner. That's a beautiful that's a nice that's, ring. That's beautiful. Yeah, yeah. How has life changed Amazing. With, with that ring on your finger and, mm. and her next to you? It's the best thing that you can do if you find the right person. Mm. If you find the right person, it's, it's beautiful. We met when we were in you know, band camp as kids. Oh, you know? wow. Really? We've been knowing each other for like the five phases of growing <laughs> up from adolescence to adulthood. You know, the, the dorky teen phase when I had braces <laughs> and baggy, baggy clothes. <laughs> you know, I, I just feel like if you have the right person, yeah. it makes life much better, mm -hmm. no matter what you're going through. Yeah. You could be going through the hardest times. You could be going through something that seems insurmountable, and you could still feel a, a peace. Yeah. Uh, and, and that's what I feel. So. Yeah. You know. One of the things I've always admired about you, um, perhaps long before it, a lot of folks showed up to the party, You've never forgotten where you came from. Mm -hmm. And not only have you not forgotten, I feel like your art pays tribute to it. It's, mm. it's this unending homage. Why is that so important to you? Oh, it's, it's given me so much. I think yeah. about everybody who has created the space for me to now have the success that I'm having. You, you have lineages, generations mm -hmm. of people, traditions that have been hard fought and established in a way that now 
someone like me who's born into all of that mm -hmm. has this opportunity as an artist to combine things that have never been combined before, take styles of music, take forms of art, put them together in ways that haven't existed before, and do it in a way that brings people this transcendent feeling. Mm -hmm. It's always more transcendent if it's bigger than yourself, if it's more than just, I'm going to lift myself up because I'm talented. You know, that's, that's over here. That's great. And everybody who is talented and has a gift, that's a beautiful thing to share. But when you think about it as something that's a continuum, yeah. it's yeah. amazing how transcendent that is. And that's yeah. the kind of joy and, and uplifting uh, catharsis that I want in my art. And it comes out through your body. Where do the moves come from? Yeah. We gotta go to break, but I just... You know how it is. Like, in fact, <laughs> hold on, hold on. You get up and you want to move. Uh, okay, oh, can you show us? Okay. Yeah, show us a little. Okay. So it's just like something about... You just kind of get... I don't know if I can do this. Become <laughs> the music. Uh -huh. Become Feel the it. music. Become the music. Come on, yeah, Billy, get it. Come the music. That's it. Become the music. Oh, I, can't, become. I can't be worse than Craig, yeah. so... This is where you're at. <laughs> All right. John, thank I'm you so gonna live. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.